Hello world. Uh, well, keep working to learn. I'm trying to learn. Uh, I have this scroller thing that I'm trying to do and watch this right here. I just watched this video from Cairo Apps and he's saying like um, or subscribe right here of it. And that is it, guys. I hope you liked the video. Please like um, or subscribe or do both. Uh, Cairo, I like the video. I like it a lot. And actually, I followed the instructions and I got to this point where I have these images right here. And if I click run, you're going to see these images and I can scroll. So far, so good. But I have a couple questions. And if you watch my video later, uh, and you know how to do it, please help me out. You can, you know, post another video and that will help another people. Or if I know the answer sooner, I will also do that. So I got this color here and look, see? I have one, watch, one, two, three, four, and then five images. And I can do the scroll. So far, so good. Okay, but I have a couple questions. First, I'm going to quit this. First, how do I add more images? That's the first question. Because if I have, I only have five and I did the images really small. But if I have 10 images and the images are bigger, let's say I have the image like this size. I'm just saying, okay? I have that one, one. Control copy, control V, I have two. How do I add the next look? See, there's nothing that I can. And if I just put it right there, just let me go down. But how do I move this up to add another one? You see, control, copy, control B. I have another one. I'm just going to put it down here somewhere. I don't know. I just put it down there. Let me see. I have four pictures. And if I click this one, this one in the bottom, I don't think it's going to show. Just let me put this three. But how do I add more? Watch. There you go. And two questions I have. Okay, this is one. Running. I don't know this picture is what's going to happen. There you go. And I only have one, two, three, and that's it. And you have three, but there is no four. So the question is, how can I add more pictures or images or buttons or whatever? Like if I want this to be a button, I can just make a custom button. And then, uh, you know, if people click in there, they can go somewhere else. Like if I get... A button right here and I drag a button and I just make it this one big or whatever and then I just make this a custom button there and I can add the picture there image right here now this becomes a button that when people click in here they can go somewhere else so I think that's how it's gonna work but how do I add more? Okay. Now, the other question that I have, I'm going to show you in a minute. I'm just going to try this, the button to see it there. There. It's a button. I click in there. It's not taking me anywhere. So this, you can see that it's a button that will take me somewhere. So that's good. Now, there you go. So how do I add more? Okay. Now, I'm just going to quit this. Now, and the other question is, I have the same thing that I'm trying to do, and this is at that XIB. And then when I go to the storyboard, because I'm doing a project in a storyboard, I have the same code. And the problem that I have is the same problem that I've been having in YouTube. And I've been, there's a lot of people with the same problem that I haven't found the answer. I have the files owner. Click on the files owner, and you go right here. You see this scroller on outlet. Just drag it there and put you drag it there to the, the scroll view and that's it. You make the connection. When you go to this area and you don't have 
the files on it. So I don't have the connection here and I click on this view controller and I don't see any scroll right here. Manual, trigger, search, relationship, nothing. So view, there's nothing here. Then I go to first responder. I see receive actions, but I don't see the scroller here. So this scroll view, I don't see it where I can make the connection there. And if I right click, I see this, but it's still nothing happened there. There's nothing here in the bottom. So I'm just lost. I don't know what to do with the problem with the storyboard. So if I can make the connection, same as this, the connection to the storyboard, and also trying to make fit more images. Well, and one last question, if you know it, I have six minutes. I have a couple minutes, maybe more. If I run this, application is going to say fail, maybe. Yes, no, succeed. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can show this. But I have, I have a scroll view right here on this black, white area, and I have a back button. So, what I'm trying to do is, I guess, uh, I have this iPad right here. Watch. Give me one second. There you go. You have an image. Click on this one. Takes you somewhere else. And when I go here. I got a pop-up, there you go. This this is the white thing that I have in this area. And this is scroller, maybe in this right here. So the question is, if I get all this white part as a scroll view, and then all this will be a scroll with a lot of you know buttons and things, but if I can make this one, the white area, smaller. How can I make this on a particular size. Let's say I just wanted like half, like maybe half of a window. I cannot see it here. But if I get this and just make it, you know, short, like half of a width of the screen, and then uh, maybe like a little, just a, a little pop up, you know, pop over, uh, just tiny. Or I can make the size of this pop over a different size, like a custom size with. Uh, I don't know how to explain it, but I hope you're getting the idea. So to make it like the scroll just like that. See, when I pop up, I have all this is big. It looks like that. I guess this is the way, best, best way to explain. Like that. When I put the, the, uh, the button, it goes this big. How can I make it like if I want it like that? And then I just want it like that. So if I have a button here that says help or whatever and then I just get one little window here and uh, this would be a scroll view with buttons that you can scroll kind of like uh, I don't know if you ever seen the the Sims game has something like that right here in the bottom that you click and you see a little popover where you see all the Sims there and you can scroll there's a lot of Sims kind of like that idea so I want to do that I want to do the uh, connections between the buttons and also adding more images. So if anybody knows that, please help me out and post the answer on YouTube. Thank you. Bye-bye.